gets me into that space, that trance space. The beautiful thing about abstraction, you know, it's just throwing caution to the wind. And then the beautiful mistake, you know, the, the mistake is a big part of how I paint. It's supposed to be as Chester Bennington from Lincoln Park. I'm kind of what you call an automatic painter. And I, I just paint kind of stream of consciousness. I've been painting since I was a little kid. I loved to draw dinosaurs as a child. That was, a, that was all I drew, dinosaurs. This music resonates with a lot of us, you know, and I thought we should honor them. My name is Nicola Carpinelli, and I'm a painter here in Bend, Oregon. Everything was going great. I had different collectors collecting my work, and uh, then I opened up my own art gallery in Seattle. We have our guy, Kurt Cobain, and we don't know what people are going through in their lives, you know. I fell into a depression after my divorce, and I uh, had thoughts of ending it all, you know. Um, it was uh, a really hard time for me. I had several, uh, uh, several times where I, I was uh, feeling suicidal, uh, and a couple of times where I actually attempted. I was in a place where I could not look in the mirror anymore. I, I, it was like I hated the reflection, and painting is such, is that, is a reflection of yourself. Um, it's like looking in the, in the mirror. So, um, painting a show for World Suicide Awareness Day on the September 10th at the Peterson Roth Gallery. This is a very, very important topic. We need to address this. It's like I get visited by their ghosts, it feels like sometimes. It feels like uh, I have this connection with them. It's super important to, to keep it alive. And knowing when to stop is, you know, a big part of it, right? Renoir once said, you have to make art thinking you can change the world. But also, you must be humble enough to think if you touch two people, you've done something extraordinary. That's what you hope to do with the show, right? And that's what I hope to do, do with the show. That if we just reach two people, one person, we've, we've saved the world.